Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome to episode 9. I'm recording this in advance, and I can't remember because my mind is shit. But I think it's episode 9 of Motorsport Manager, and we've got an interview with Sky Sports, so we've got to take that first, don't we? You must be delighted with your podium finish. Great result, obviously. Thanks for the stupid question. Can I struggle finishing? Yeah. Um... It was very, I'm just going to be honest. It was shit. He was shit. Nothing we can say that about that. Right. We've got almost 10 mazillion pounds in the bank. The car's been repaired. That's good. We're going to build a new one in a second. Hopefully. Oh, prize money. Prize money. Okay. Oh, we've got lots of... Okay. Um, oh, Jensen Button has retired. It's about right, isn't it? Real life. Prize money. I'm happy to present you with the prize money. Do not try... Okay, how much is it? How much is it? Ooh! 11 million pounds! 11 million dollars! Right, manager of the season. It's, it's not going to be us, is it? Uh, driver of the season. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, yeah. Another retirement. Another retirement. Okay, all good. When do the contracts actually run out? Okay, so the new rules, uh, we've got um, spec brakes, meaning that we don't have to worry about brakes. Everybody's got exactly the same brakes for this season. Um, they've been promoted, that's fine. Uh, Asia Pacific, uh, Mucky Motorsport. <laughs> Mucky Motorsport. Okay, so they're probably going to be quite good uh, where Trident will drop down to take their place. Okay, Trident. Okay, I, I don't know. Right, I think we need to get rid of Ilot. It's a sad day. We're not having him killed off. I don't know why I did that. Preseason. Right, here we go. Preseason. Fun times, fun times. Okay, PK. Okay, good, good. Car design unlocked. Here we go. Design next year's car. We've got so much money to spend. Car parts, 7 million. That's carried forward. We've got so much money. We might not be able to make the best car, but what we're going to be able to do is is spend money on buildings and spend a lot of money on, on building a better car. So here we go, engine supplier. So, so basically it's sort of it's improvability and fuel efficiency. So we can go all out and get a medium car, gives us plus four, costs 4.6 million. Um, it's not quite got the fuel efficiency of Mersault, which is... Got medium, medium, very weak, base stat modifier. So that gives plus four to all stats. I don't mind this, actually. We don't want to don't go too crazy with it, because we do want to spend money in other areas as well. So we're not just going to instantly pick the best thing. We, we can always go back to it once we spent more money. Okay, so fuel supplier. Um, so this one is medium fuel efficiency, but improvability is very weak, as opposed to just weak. Again, I think I'm going to go for middle ground. Um, material suppliers, tyre wear and tyre heating. Interesting. Do we go weak, weak or medium, very weak for an extra one and a half million? <coughs> I think we go weak, weak. I like tyre heating is definitely an issue. So we're spending a lot of money so far. Like right, brake supplier. We got... Sp and we got spec brakes this season. We've got spec brakes, haven't we, though? Oh, that, oh this has an effect on tyre wear, so it probably still does count. Okay, so tyre heating. We, I think we're going to go big on this one. JP. Right, so it's costing us 11.5 million. Um, tyre wear is 2.5 star. Tyre heating, 2.5 star. It's, it's a much better car. Um, we can't change the all that stuff because that's locked in. Right. Oh, that's a oh, that's a bill and a half, isn't it? What a check to write. Let's design the new chassis. We can choose colours. We can make colourry, colourry pretty stuff. Um, oh, that, that's what uh, it's going to be finished on fifth of March. Okay, where are we? December. Okay. Right. Next thing. It's a sad moment for us all, everyone. Callum Eilot, possibly the worst driver known to mankind. Um, He's got thir we're gonna have to pay him. He's got thirteen months left, but I'm not having him for another year. Quarter of a meal. Pfft, what's that, eh? What's that? 
Bosch. Okay, so we automatically get like a random crappy one just to fill the gap because you obviously need two drivers. And then we're going to go to our scouting and have a look at what who all the drivers that we've scouted. So this guy, Stephen Goldstein from Argentina, he's not going to come, is he? Because he's already in the World Mo Motor Championship. Um, frustrated. Oh, he's a reserve driver. Mm, okay, maybe he might want to take the step down. Um Let's approach him. Okay, that's fair enough. Always better to ask, though, isn't it? You never know. <sighs> okay. The next one I was looking at, really, uh, the, the realistic, like, Charles Leclerc is the best driver here, but he's earning a crap ton, and we have to pay almost £2 million to get his contract. Um, we could look at... Let's try him. It's a lot of money. We'll try him. It's unlikely he's going to want to come. Cor oh, I can't corner. That's quite important cornering, I would have said. Um, but his consistency is very good. Feedback is great, so that's really good for practice. Overtaking is okay. Cornering and fitness are the issues here. Still only 21. He can still improve a little bit. I don't think he's going to come, though. So... That whole discussion was pointless. Right, what? so this guy's the next up. Xiong Liao. Um, smoothness. Okay, consistency's bad. Feedback is good. He'd make a really good reserve driver. He's only 18, though. He's a wonder kid. P plus 50 potential. And he likes racing snowmobiles. You know, who doesn't, who, who doesn't want that? Oh, okay. We're going back. We just want to see who else. So... Both these China motorsport drivers, but Hyong Lao's the, the, the better one. I quite like Jack Brabham, though. Look, he's got a lot of potential. He's going to cost us a lot cheaper to get if he wants to come, that is. Maybe not because he's in the Asia Pacific, which is the next one, is it? But I, I would like a British team if possible. He doesn't look 19. He's ugly, but he's a born leader. Damn it. Yeah, I didn't think he was going to drop down. That was the one I was quite interested in. And then we can go for somebody that's a little bit less experienced with a lot of potential. Shen Kui. Oh, dear. Oh. Sorry, love. I think we go for that one that we looked at then. We, the other option is... Xiang Wei Chao. Um, lightning. What? Lightning reaction. Oh, I thought it was, okay, I thought it said lightning restrictions. And he's dumb. <laughs> Some of these driver traits are brilliant. I'm stupid. Right, he's 18, so it's the choice. Is there, there is there a compare? I'm sure there's a compare thing, yeah. Let's compare him with... Um, 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 where's the other dude? Where is the other dude? Favourites? No, he's not a favourite. Oh, it's that one, is it? No, that's the one I'm looking at. Xiong Wan Chao. Why? Okay. Your guess is as good as mine. Um, okay, let's just look at them then, like old school. Okay, so his big weakness here, he's got good finish, good overtaking, so he can't break or corner. They are important things, I'd, I'd say. Um... And the other guy is probably a better overall, I would say. And I do like the feedback. His smoothness and consistency. So he's going to do well some races. He's going to do shite some races. He's a wonder kid as well. Is the other guy one counts as a wonder kid? Yeah, let's go. For, let's go for the wonder kid. Why would you not have a wonder kid? He's got bags of potential. Let's do it. Approach driver. Start. Starting to go, right, this is weird, <laughs> right? This negotiation thing. You kind of have to guess, right? So his existing contract, he's getting 200 grand away. So we can't go lower than what he's, we'll go 250. 250 is a nice little pay rise. Wages are fairly important to me. Um, I think we go equal status. I'd want, I like two drivers that have equal status, but he says it's not important. So maybe we just make him number two because he doesn't care that much. 
No, I like equal status. I hate I hate team orders and shit in Formula One. So I'm gonna stick with it and go let them race, right? I prefer a short contract where we're not gonna give you that one. But okay, we'll give you 24 months, right? I'm not gonna give you a year. Is that even? A, yeah, it's a year. Okay, I'll play. Uh, look, I don't mind who pays the. No, I'll pay it all, mate. That's just the kind of guy I am, right? And we're quite rich at the moment, so fuck it. Okay, now this is the stuff that's kind of just guessing. Um, 300 is the maximum we can offer. We've got money, so I prefer just to win him over. We could, Oh, we couldn't go further about coming. Ooh, right, 300. I'm happy to pay that just to get him on board. A race bonus. Now, this is quite interesting. So if we get... If he finishes... I like the idea of top six. It's quite important. What's the maximum we can offer? So you kind of just have to guess. When you haven't done this a lot and you don't have the experience, you're kind of like... Meh. And this is his patience meter. So we send in the contract. He'll then decide how crap we are at it. I think that's a really generous deal. But I'm happy to pay it. Right. Proposal sent. Bosh. Done. I'm fired? What were you thinking? This is ridiculous. I thought we were going to try and win things together. Now I know that's always all a lie. Screw you, Loki. Screw <laughs> He clearly has no idea that he is very, very shit at driving. Right. Also, we could look at upgrading the other people. Let's get this first. Okay. Um, okay. China Motorsport. He's accepted it. Boom! Like I say, I might have paid over the odds a little bit, but I'm I'm happy to get him on board. He is a very good driver in the making. Um, Yosu Trueblood! That's what we're going to get rid of. He's that little one that we got hired in. Um, sign on fee. Yep, all good. All good. This is all relatively new to me, so... Okay, so... He's in. We've got two very good drivers. They're both equal status. Next up, I wouldn't mind a better reserve driver. So reserve drivers aren't massively important, but if they've got really good feedback, you often have like a youngster with a lot of potential there or a really good somebody with really good feedback that you can use in the practice sessions to get it. Um, I don't think we've... Um, I don't want to pay over the odds, to be on. to be honest. So I'm not going to worry too much. We'll have a quick look if there's anybody like non-contra. Like Shen Kui um, with good feedback. That's the most important thing. So no is the answer to that very easy question. I'm not worried about somebody that can become a really good driver. We've got two drivers with a lot of potential. We just need somebody with good feedback. There's probably a way of sorting through this easier. But um, I don't want to... Uh, I lot. Let's get him in. Two feedback. What a legend he is of the racing world. Um, we've got Felipe Nunes. Okay. He's just an awful driver. Makes I lot look like a superstar. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. I'm a better driver and I can't even drive. Okay. Okay, we're not going to worry about that. So the next step on the staff front we've got we've sorted that out earlier on we've got two very good potential race mechanics um obviously she's just started um working with her new driver hung liao um so but these two i don't want to change i think i think they're really good charlotte williams however not the best right not the best good potential but i'd rather have somebody as my lead designer that's just good at the job these are the known components of the sort of stuff she unlocks like on the simple parts minus one build day rubbish performance plus 20 to max well i'm yeah, not a fan of that either yeah so we'll have a look so we'll have a look for uh lead designers shall we um it's in scouting isn't it designers okay right <clears throat> ba -ba -ba. so so some of these People are never, ever going to come to us, are they? Because they're like Red Bull and Ferrari. I don't think they're going to take the step down. But there's some unemployed people here. Unemployed people always need a job. 
Let's go. For, let's have a look at John O'Brien. We, I want to get British people in. Engine good. Rear wing good. Gearbox good. Brakes here. <laughs> so so. Um, we've got build time plus ten days. Un unlocks an additional great component slot. Rel oh, reliability plus two percent for each day in production. That's quite nice. Production produce an additional part for no extra cost or time. Okay, I'm liking you, John. I'm liking you. Let's just check out some of your competition. This guy looks like a bloody superstar. So we don't know. So he has got these, hasn't he? But we just don't know them. These leads are those different. These components. They may learn new components. Okay. Engine, not so good, but everything else is amazing. I don't think it'll come, really. Yeah. I think we're aiming a little bit too high, but I wanted to check out what. What we're up against here. Mitchell Abrahams is a Zed Evigan. Good all rounder. Gearbox and ring is the problem. Um, we can get stuff built quicker. I'm not really worried about the speed. Good components take no time to build. Okay, I don't mind the stuff instantly getting built. Let's see if there's. Let's see how far down the ladder we need to go before people actually will be interested. Let's have a look at John then, see if we'll. All right, John, got a new motor? No, no, he hasn't got a new motor. Okay. Um, Claire White, 37 years old. Engine brakes are good. Build time there. Uh, two days for half a million. Not, not a massive fan. Adds a random legendary component. Let's just see. Oh, okay. That's annoying because I don't like her components quite as much as some of the others. But she is very good at what she does. Okay. We'll keep an eye on you, Claire. You're in, you're in the process. Um, then we've got Braylon Stockwell. Uh, performance plus 15% from reliability. Okay, I don't mind that. Those would be interesting. Because the reliability is obviously bad. When you first create a part, the reliability is crap anyway. But then you can work on that. So that might... His rear wing is... Three, which is ridiculous. But look at that. Suspension, brakes, and front wing. Engine and gearbox are decent. I'm going to go for this guy. And he's got potential to get better. This is definitely an upgrade. Right. He's unemployed, so I've got... F I have no idea what I'm... He's got no patience either. I've got no idea how much I'm supposed to offer this guy. Not... Not... Wages are important. Brilliant. So I can offer you between 160 and 400. I feel like there should be a little bit more help on this bit. 186, yeah? He wants a long contract. That's good because we want to keep him for the long term. Um, a signing on fee of 200. And a race target of 6. We'll stick with our theme. 36. No idea. <coughs> Ba, 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 ba. We got Xiong Liao. Right, we're going to see what's going on here then. Um, okay, renegotiation. Hmm, interesting. Let's go back. Okay, this is my last chance. <laughs> okay, he's good. he wants a lot of money. I suppose he is very good, but he wants. He's delighted with the contract length, and he's insulted by everything. I don't think we're going to be able to get this done. I'm not going to offer him 400 grand a race. We'll bankrupt ourselves. If we don't get him, I'll get somebody else. I'm not. We can we can afford the sign on fee, so we'll we'll try and give him that. He's insulted by that. Right, that's it, mate. I'm not I'm not going to go nuts with you, right? Okay. Because Charlotte Williams has got a bit of potential, but it's going to take us so long to get there. I'd rather look at it. Look at the difference. We'll see if he comes in. If not, we'll we'll go. We'll go with somebody else. Okay. Um, that's my backup driver. That's fine. Hi, Loki. Me and a few engineers are worried about the car's improvability over the course of the season. We've had a few preliminary talks with our engine supplier, and they think they could help us out for a price. Heart, one and a half million for plus one improvability. Yeah. Go on, then. Seem plus one for one and a half million seems like a bargain. 
I don't know if I've got a fucking clue if that's a bargain or not. It's probably really expensive, but... Okay, he's, he's rejected the contract. We expected that. I'm not... I was just not going to be... I'm not going to be held to ransom. Okay. Um, we want to go back into staffy scouting, don't we? Here we go. So that was John O'Brien. Was I can't even remember who the fuck that was. All right, so we move. Oh no, that was. Uh, ooh, Frederick Kelly, five star potential, and he's pretty good. What's he got? Nah, nah. Oh, I quite like that. The risk level minus one because when you start building those little dodgy parts, you can get done for cheating. I quite like that, and he's got. We'll see what he wants. See what he wants. Okay, here we go again. I imagine he's going to want a lot. 300. A medium contract. Well, I'm happy with that. Okay, he's got a little bit more patience than the last guy. We'll go 600 grand because we can afford that. And then we're going to go 63. I think what we should do is also talk to somebody else in case that doesn't work out okay this guy looks interesting four and a half star potential he's it's a half a million to break his contract but i wonder if he'd be interested um reliability plus 25 percent like that not too bothered about that don't mind that um, suspension front wing, gearbox brakes, engine and rear wing. Yeah, he's not interested. So step down, isn't it? Step down, that's the problem. Um, any more big potential? I like. I want to build a team of potential. Ruby Smith. What we got? What you got there? Plus 20 to max. Right, okay, don't mind that. Don't mind that. Don't mind that. Okay, you don't know anything about brakes. Rear wing engine is nice, and the rest are sort of pretty average. The brakes. Do we need brakes? Brakes an important thing? No. No. Right. Okay, so she's a little bit less skilled, so I'm hoping I don't have to pay her, like, ridiculous amounts of money. Prefers a long contract. I like that, love. That shows commitment. I'll give you a nice signing on fee. And we'll do the sixth. Bosch. Okay, so we've got there, Bosch. Right. When do we get to paint our car funny colour? I like paint. I want to paint the car. <laughs> um, four hundred or or one. It's pretty similar, isn't it? But that's. Bango. Bango Barbecue. We've got to go for Bango Barbecue. Why would you not choose Bango Barbecue? I'm going to build a building. That's what I'm going to do. Let's build a building because it probably takes a while. Okay. I've never built a building before, so bear with me. So what we have at the moment is a design centre, one of le level 1 of 4, and a factory level 1 of 4. So we can upgrade for £8 million. Pounds. It gets a wind tunnel, simulate handle fifty percent tool centre, fifty percent helipad. Oh, that's the other bits. Um, does it sort of the centre? Oh, so that means you can design better parts, doesn't it? I believe because can I move it? No. Okay. Factory. This is where the car is built, repaired, and tweaked for flow. upgrading the factory helps towards unlocking new buildings. Um, So it gives us plus 10 parts development staff. Four extra parts. Oh, so we can improve more at the same time. That's quite nice. I like that so far. It's a, it's a bargain price of £8 million. Pounds. Um, so the parts take longer, uh, shorter to design. I, I'm liking the factory so far. Right, so new buildings. Okay, we can't... These are all locked... So you need level 2 factory for a lot of this stuff and design centre. Okay, so we've got a choice of three. We've got the forecasting centre. means we get better weather forecast so we can see further into the future during race days. It's a nice thing to have. £6 million. Scouting facilities means you can... Um, 
you can uh, unlocks more unscattered drivers from different championships. A variety of drivers also improved. So better driver quality. I quite like that. We might build that second. I don't know if we can build buildings at the same time. But it's only £2 million, so that might be worth doing. And a staff centre. Okay, this is important because we've built a team of really high potential people. So anything that... Like our, our new lead designer, our race mechanics to improve their skills also allows the drivers to better their fitness. I'm 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 liking this. I'm I'm loving this. I'm building it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Bosh. We need to save a big chunk of money because we're gonna be designing parts all the time. There it is. That was quick. We're already under construction. Okay, we don't want to spend all our money because we need to spend time and money building parts and all that good shit so okay so okay contract renegotiation oh, okay not only insulted by one thing that's a good sign that's a good sign she's lost a bit of patience but okay um that's all i can offer so hopefully that's uh she's insulted by the signing on fee we'll go big with a fucking full there there Come on, love. That is that's got to be close to what you wanted, right? Um, <coughs> so they're both considering it now. The question is, who do we? Who would we want? Probably go big, Frederick Kelly, five star potential. He's already a bit ahead as well. I'm not sure if he's going to be interested in. Okay. Oh, okay. That's a lot of money, Beret. That's a lot of money. That's all I can do. And he's insulted. So it's very, very unlikely that he's going to take that. Okay. Good. Yes, Ruby! Bloody marvellous. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. That's a massive upgrade as well. Loving it. Um signage replace sorry charlotte thank you very much uh, you know you did you did all right bosh brand new lead designer oh things are looking up we've got look at the potential the potential in our thing is ridiculous we've got um potential on our drivers Hyung liao i think he doesn't look asian does he it's weird um i'm very happy with that an important signing to Megu for Tech. Uh, Ruby Smith has been announced as a new lead designer. Smith will take control of the team's design department. Um, we'll be happy to see some improvements. Fairly sharpish. The good times are on the way. Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Is the good times? Um. Oh, no. Oh, no. We, we decided we wanted the... Yeah, she, he was... She was she was, he was too expensive anyway. That's okay. He was over double the wages. We don't want to uh, bankrupt. Yeah, are you sure to cancel? Yes. I don't want to spend too much money on wages and stuff because you can end up spending a crap ton and making no profit. And we want to be able to advance the buildings and stuff like that. So we still do need to make a profit. So that's why I've gone for these sort of young drivers that are going to improve. Okay, um, Fitter Powdy has volunteered at a local homeless shelter. Well done, mate. You get marketability. Oh, that's not, that's all right. Take it, take it. Better sponsors. I'll have that. Oh, okay, the press have visited the headquarters. Um, okay. Our readers, our partners would be interested in, in your team if you were to write a good article. In other, on the other hand, we wrote a bar. Okay, so you're basically blackmailing. Come in! Yes, morale's minus fifteen. He's, he's full morale anyway, so that's that's not going to be a problem. Right, we'll get to designing the car, and then we'll sort of finish the episode there because we're going to get along a bit crazy if not. Um, yes, do the livery right. I don't think we can change everything. We can't change full colours. It, it's it's a particular colour scheme, I, I believe. Right, stop rotating the car for a sec. Thank you. Oh, that's annoying. Is it just going to continually rotate regardless? Okay, so these are the basic setups with the colours I've got. Oh, bit of dragon. 
Um, I think one of the biggest things is important that it stands out. Oh, my word, that stands out. While we're watching it, nice, easy. That That's green, isn't it? Oh, we could just be a big bogey. Oh, mm, I can't. I don't mind that orange. I quite, I quite like that. It's a bit like Force India, but I don't mind that. And what trim colours can we have? Like a lighter orange, just to accent the trim there. You see on the little. Yeah, I like that. Have we got a different colour green? There's like literally no other green. That's quite a big part of it. It should be green, shouldn't it? It should definitely should be green. Right, let's have a look at that as a basic model, and then we'll try the different... No. No. Don't mind that one. I quite like that. I quite like that. Bit of tiger. Oh, that's quite... I like the line down the side there. Go faster stripe. Don't mind that. That's all right as well. Ooh, ooh. I think it's between that and the tiger stripe. I quite like that. Yes, I'm liking that, my friends. I'm liking that a lot. It, it stands out in a crowd. Right. Bosch. New car for the new season. Predator Racing Group. Or well, Fortec, as we modded it. There it is. It's looking good. Chassis makeup. And then what we'll be able to do at the uh, beginning of next episode is start actually improving the car, build our first parts and everything like that. It's a lot of a better car. We've got money to spend on new parts. So we've got better drivers, a better driver, iLot's gone, and we've got better um, lead designer. Everybody else is improving. We're building the staff set now. I think it's going to be a good season. We're going to have a much better season. Hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. A little bit more behind the scenes. No race today, but I quite enjoyed doing that. I, like, I've only ever done one complete season before, so this is all pretty new to me and stuff. So I might have fucked it up, but if you don't know about this channel, I'm, I don't try to be like the best at everything. I like to just do fun stuff that sounds interesting and stuff like that. So you're welcome to give me advice in the comments. Um, I may well ignore it, but you can try. Thank you very much for joining me, guys. If you did enjoy this video, please hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Come on, the green and orange. Three.